of picking that that piece of music for for the movie? Well, one of the, well, I just love. Yeah, Charles Bernstein just wrote a couple of really, in particularly fantastic stings in White Lightning, and um, that uh, one of them I used uh, in, uh, in the uh, in the movie *Inglorious Bastards*, and another one I and I also used it also in *Kill Bill*, and I just always loved those stings. But then there's the opening theme song to *White Lightning*, which, in, if you've seen the movie, is where they you know uh, uh, take the two hippie boys out on the canoe, and, and, and actually one of the more horrifying, haunting. Openings. It's really chilling because it's so reminiscent of the Civil Rights Movement. Oh, it's, completely. You can't see that and not think about that. And it's only this, a little more than 10 years after that stuff yeah. happened. And it's, I mean, you know, the, the casting of both Ned Beatty and that other old hillbilly guy who you don't know, he doesn't even have a line, all right, but he just looks just so correct. Yeah. And the same thing with the struggling hippies in, in, in the canoes. They just, everyone's doing a fantastic job. And I just remember that opening was just very, very, very haunting. I thought it was terrific. And they never did a soundtrack album, The White Lightning. So Charles Bernstein, after I used the one track from White Lightning, he sent me, he sent me all the tracks from it. And so I've just had them for a couple of years. And as I was going through the, my music, looking for different pieces, I came across uh, the opening title theme. And I go, hey, that, that could be not a theme for the bastards per se, but something that would be really interesting to show them doing their thing. Pretty good at that. Why you get to Carnegie Hall, don't you? Practice. And to play this twangy, country, haunting theme in the middle of a World War II movie that takes place in, in France, I thought was a neat thing. It was brought, brings the Americanness. It kind of almost acts as a, as a uh, echoing theme for uh, Aldo because he's from the south and it and, and there's also because of uh, from the movie it's from there's also a, a sinister there's a sinister quality to that theme from White Lightning and I like the fact that there's, there's a sinister quality uh, underscoring the bastards and what they do